Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizish.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can put HTML into your categories as, page, as the category content, your concierge content, we'll call it. So here's a sample category, and see this section here above the category, how you have all this text? Well, I want to show you how you can put HTML in it because by default, there is no HTML button to use and stuff to make it easy. So uh, let me show you exactly what I mean first. So we're at our buyers category here. So let's go into our categories. Oh, by the way, this is in your admin panel on the left hand side under posts. Go to categories and you'll open up this page here. Now, in this category section, you want to find the category you want to add HTML to. So here we have buyers because this is the buyers page we want to add HTML into, into this section. And then when you scroll down, you'll see you have the section called introductory headline. This changes your title here if you want. And then under introductory content, this is of course the content. I'm going to make this bigger. This is of course the content that we're seeing here. But here's the issue that you're going to face. There are no HTML buttons and there, there's nothing, there's no simple way for you to add HTML without knowing code. Except for doing it this way that I'm about to show you. It's kind of a little, um, it's a cheat way to do it, but it works. What you want to do is go to posting in a new window, go under posts, and click on add new. And once you get the add new window, you'll, it'll bring you to a page just like this. right here which is your pretty much your posting screen and now in this section this has all the HTML items you would need so here's what you want to do first add a bunch of text I'm gonna quickly add some right now so there we go I've added a bunch of text here and now after you add text let's go ahead and now start adding HTML to it like you would do a normal blog post so let's just say you want to make this text bold let's, I'm just gonna do random things let's just make things bold let's make some things italic let's change some colors of some so let's say that we want to make it red text so now that's red and now of course the other one let's say we want to add headings so let's say here on here here is a heading and what you do is you look at this button you scroll down and hit heading three so now we have a heading there and now let's just say you want to add one more heading here is even another heading and now we want to select this, open this up, put heading 2 or 3, it's up to you. I like doing heading 3's since you're in categories already, or heading 2's, but just make them consistent. Um, and now from here, what you want to do, oh, actually, let me rephrase that. Do heading 2's, preferably. Do heading 2's first, and then anything below heading 2's, if it's part of the same paragraph, do heading 3's. I'm just going to show you an example with both. All right, so now let's just say another thing you want to add is a picture. Let's say you want to add a picture and you want it to be aligned to the right, let's say. Well, all you got to do is click on Upload, Insert, and I'm going to quickly find a picture, and I'm going to just I'm going to take it from the media library, and I'm going to insert it into the blog posting like you normally would. So here's a picture here. Let's scroll down. We're going to align it to the right. We want it to be medium size because 300, remember, nothing bigger than 623 or else it's too big for the posting section. So we want it like about half the size. Now I'm going to insert it into the post. And we'll see it here on the right side. And there we have our picture. Now we have our heading. And let's do one final thing. Let's say you want a bullet point. So here is text. Let's say you want a bullet point. You click here. We're going to click on the bullet point button, of course, on our screen. Now we scroll down. Here's our bullet point. One more. And then and another. So now we have a full HTML style posting. Obviously this is just dummy text and everything, but just to show you, you could just modify everything here. Now the question is, how do you take this text and put it into your category in this section? Well, here's what you gotta do. In this section here, click on HTML. Now you're gonna have all the HTML code and everything you need. All you gotta do is select all the text, copy it, now go here and select all this text, delete it, and then paste that new text. After that, click update. And what we're gonna, what we just now created, is an HTML, HTML page or HTML content for our landing category page. So now here was our, here's our buyer category. When I hit refresh, this is gonna upload with all the HTML that we just inserted. And there it is, all said and done. We have our title, we have our image to the right, our bold text, our bold text, our headings here. Then we have our color text, we have our bullet points, and then of course our other heading. So that's the way to put HTML into your landing category pages. All right, it's a little bit of a short, a little cheat way to do it, but it still works really, really great. All right, so now remember, you can also put videos into this section. Just check out the normal video tutorials. 
on how to embed videos into your WordPress posts and everything here and just follow the same process that I'm showing you in this tutorial. It's the same exact steps. All right, so that's pretty much everything on adding landing, adding uh, custom, con uh, custom HTML content to your landing categories. So if you have any questions, go to facebook.com forward slash tizish, the way you see it spelled up here, and ask me there. All right, well, good luck and take care.